My name is Taro Alexander, and I'm the founder of SAY, the Stuttering Association for the Young. SAY is a 501c3 not-for-profit organization that is dedicated to improving the confidence and the communication skills in young people who stutter. I have stuttered since I was about five years old, and I grew up not meeting anyone else who stutters until I was 26. And growing up with stuttering as a, as a challenge was, was really hard. Um, I, I grew up feeling very alone and isolated. Um, I always felt like the odd person out. Um, and I didn't even know this back then, but I, I think the thing that I wanted so badly was to be around other people that understood what stuttering was like. And so when I got into my mid-20s, I started to think about what was out there for kids. And um, I didn't see anything like Say. I didn't see anything that was uh, really fun and creative and um, community building. I wanted young people who stutter to know that there's a place where they can come and uh, feel great about who they are and know that who they are is good enough and that you can be someone who stutters and still achieve anything you want in life. One of my favorite nonprofit organizations is called the 52nd Street Project, which is actually where we are right now. Um, I have volunteered with the 52nd Street Project since I moved in New York um, in uh, 1991. Uh, so I've been involved with them for a long time. And they're a wonderful nonprofit that creates original theater with kids um, in this neighborhood. So we have a lot of really exciting things coming up at Say. Um, we do a two weeks leap away summer camp called Camp Say that takes place in the Pocono Mountains of Pennsylvania. So really excited about that. That's coming up at the very end of July. Uh, before that, we're doing a one-day version of Camp Say in Houston, Texas. Um, and we're also doing the George Springer Bowling Benefit in Texas as well. Um, and then in the fall, we have also some really exciting things. We'll be doing a Paul Rudd Bowling Benefit here in NYC, as well as our one act shows where three or four t t t teenagers write and direct their own original shows that are performed by professional actors. And then we're also doing a, uh, a short version of Camp Say in California and a short version of Camp Say in Memphis, Tennessee. So a lot of really exciting things going on at Say over the next six months and uh, if you're in any of those places, hope you come and check it out.